Hey guys, Richard Blaine here. Thanks for stopping by my Easy Cooking channel and Mr. Knife Knife and Gear Reviews channel, okay? Today, I'm not going to be doing a product review. Today, I thought I would take a tour, give you guys a tour of the shop where I work, show you just how many knives and swords and cool stuff I have in here to play with, okay? It's a big shop. It's really packed with fun stuff, and it's a fun place to work. So I thought I would give you a tour because... Just about anything you can think of, of ever want in the cutlery world, knife world, I have in here. And then, if you would like to order anything, you can contact me here at the shop or send me an email, and I'll email you some catalogs. I'll have the links for the emails in the description. So without any further ado, let's get going. Let's take a tour of my shop. All right, guys. So let's see what somebody sees the second they walk into the door. Oh, my. Yes, there's some glare there, so I'll do it down here. Cold steel. Cold steel knives. Every model of cold steel knife you could ever imagine. Okay. Sorry about the disarray in the display cases, but my display cases are severely overstocked. So we have more knives than any cutlery store in the country. Unfortunately, it can get a little bit messy. They're the long blades. Cold steel. Zippo lighters. More Zippo lighters. More Zippo lighters. Okay. Here's the top shelf. It's a little bit dirty. Sorry, I haven't had a chance to get to it. But then they move on over. And they find Mora of Sweden. Okay. And Muela of Spain. Buoys. Stag-handled knives. Hunting knives. We get lots of hunters buying this stuff year in, year out. High-end Damascus buoy. More buoys, more skinners from Whale of Spain. Very popular brand here in Las Vegas. Okay. More Muela. More Mora. Scandy ground knives. Very popular here in Vegas. Down here, Boker Arbolito. Muela. More Muela. Lots and lots of Muela. Okay. People love it. It's a great price. Okay. Then we move on over to the next case. And we have case knives. There's the new Case Carhartt line, and here's traditional Case Trappers, and Stockmen's, and Doctor's Knives, and Folding Hunters, and models that haven't been around for years and years and years. We have a lot of old stock, and we'll duck down, and we have Boker of Germany, and Bear and Sons of Alabama, Bear Creek, more Case, more Case Yellow Boy and Boker Yellow Boy. Lots and lots of knives. More Boker. More Case. These are the Boker Plus Imports. Chad Los Banos. Very popular stuff. Some Boker Top Locks in the corner. Hard to find. Collectible. Here we have Hen and Rooster and Kissing Crane. We have a lot of people that like collecting Hen and Rooster and Kissing Crane. Okay. A couple of pieces of Franklin Mint. Don't know how they got in there. Case. More case collectibles, and we'll move on. This is one of our buck knife cases, okay? Every buck knife available, okay? We'll come on to this side. More buck. And more buck. And then I'll rotate the case. Classic buck 110s, 112s, alpha hunters, okay? Buck fixed blades, buoys, Benchmade, Harley Davidson contracted line, which they don't do any longer. Yeah, we'll come around. Buck custom shop. Okay. We'll rotate it around. More buck custom shop. And even more Buck Custom Shop Knives. Just great stuff. And we'll come around here. And here are our Benchmade Bali Songs. There's an old Frost in there. There's a couple of handmade Batangas. 51, 62, 63s. Bali Songs Makusta of Japan. Tactical Pens. 
Almar knives, very, very popular, very, very high line. More tactical pens, more Almar. Folding Sears, Falcons, Eagles, more tactical pens, more Almar. Okay. In the corner here, those are custom engraved Almars, hand engraved by a guy named Valade himself, a very popular engraver. There we go with Gerber. Old Gerber, by the way. A lot of old Gerber. Okay. And here's some more old Gerber. Then we come over here. And we have Zero Tolerance. Very popular today. And Kershaw. Very popular today. Assisted openings. Models that are still in production. Many models that are not into production anymore. Okay. Kershaw, more Zippos, more Kershaws in the corner, assisted openings, blurs, okay, more Kershaws, needs work, K-Bar zombie folder mules, those are cool, K-Bar knives made in Italy, more zero tolerance, even more zero tolerance, SOG, love SOG, okay, miscellaneous, miscellaneous, Kershaw and Miscellaneous, Sogs, Buoys. Very crowded cases I have here. More Zippos in case people like Zippos. Benchmade Gold Line. Probably one of the largest carrier of Benchmade Golds in the country. Okay. And we'll rotate the case one time. More Benchmade Gold. <coughs> this display case is all Benchmade, okay? All Benchmade. Every model Benchmade you could think of, okay? Griptilians, more Griptilians than you could shake a stick at, okay? Benchmade HK, Benchmade HK, more HK. Benchmade Lone Wolf, Bone Collector. And more Benchmade. Anything Benchmade, we have it. Benchmade fixed blades. Any Benchmade fixed blade you could think of, we have it. Emerson Karambits. Sometimes hard to find, but we have it. Here's one of my favorites, Spider Co. Okay. Every model of Spyderco known to man, we have. Okay. Every model of Spyderco known to man, we carry. Okay. Just an ocean of knives in here. Second shelf and bottom. Miscellaneous tactical fixed blades, various brands. Pick and choose. Okay. Over here. Tops. Very popular. Most popular knives in the American military right now. Tops. K bar. Ontario. EC. Anything you could shake a stick at. We have it. Leol knives from France. This is our custom and semi-custom case number one. Loaded with knives from all over the place. Gil Hibbins handmaids, factory customs, out of production lone wolves, yellow horse, case pearl collectibles, more yellow horse, more yellow horse. More yellow horse, more yellow horse, more yellow horse. Very popular. All right, guys, here we go. These are Randall's. Ty Montel from Silver City, New Mexico. Bob Lay, Chief of Arizona. These are all our custom. 
fixed blades mostly. Okay. And more. Anything you can shake a stick at. And even more. Kenetsuni of Japan. Old shred engraved from the factory. Those Gerber Mark II's were part of Pete Gerber's personal collection, hand engraved by David Pierce and David Velade, respectively. Old Buck Kalinga. Buck Damascus Dagger. Buck Scimitar in the back. Now, just to give you guys an idea of just how overstocked I am here, there's my top shelf of Buck. Second. Third. Fourth. Browning's at the bottom. You see how many boxes are on these shelves? These shelves go back three feet. Bench made. Bench made. More bench made. More bench made. More bench made. Oh my god. Look at that. Kershaw. Kershaw. Almost to the roof. You come over here. We'll cross in front of the lighter case. Even more, more Kershaw. You think I got enough knives here? More bench made. SOG and Benchmate. Okay. Leatherman. Spiderco. Spiderco. Kershaw. More Kershaw. More Kershaw. Okay. More Kershaw at the bottom. SOG at the ground level. And K bar at the ground level. And we move on. Baron Sons. Boker. Case knives. Case. 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 CRKT. More Spider Co. More Spider Co. More Boker. More Boker. More Boker. More Boker. Miscellaneous Gerbers. Okay. Pumas. Look at all this Gil Hibben stuff. Tons of the fantasy stuff. Tons of the throwing knives. I sell yards and yards and yards of this. Look at that. Zero tolerance. Stack to the roof. We duck over here. More Hibben's fantasy stuff. Okay. Cold Steel. More cold steel. More cold steel. Swiss Army. Boker. Miscellaneous. Almar. Sog. Spyderco. Miscellaneous automatics. More automatics. More automatics. More Hibbins. More fantasy. More automatics. Okay. Sharpening supplies. Gerber, Gerber, Gerber. More Gerber, Gerber. Old Gerber. Two, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten crates of Swiss Army. Old school Gerber. Yeah, see some of those Frisco shivs? Okay. Old school Gerber. A lot of stuff here, guys. Sharpening supplies. DMT, Lansky, Smith. Everyone knows I use DMT. Sharpeners, sharpeners, more sharpeners, lubricants, DMT stones. Anything you could think of to sharpen, we have it. Natural stones, synthetic stones, Japanese water stones, diamonds. It's just a nightmare to the eyes. Well, if you're a cook or a chef or a chef cook or a cook chef or a foodie like I am and you need knives for the kitchen, here's my wall of knives. More knives than you can shake a knife at. Oh, and in case I missed, yeah, there's more knives back there. Okay. Here's more knives. And more knives. More knives. Block sets for the home. Supplies. More knives. Dexter Russell's. Old school walnut and plastic. If you're a foodie or a chef and you're in need of knives or knife supplies, okay, we're it. And here's all our back stock for knives. There's another eye full. Literally to the roof. Mac of Japan, that's my favorite. Global, more global. 
And if we turn around, knives and scissors and more scissors and more scissors. Any kind of chore you need scissors for, we have the scissors you need. Okay guys, thanks for stopping by the shop. You took the tour, you see how crowded it is in here. I'm going to leave some links down in the description. You can send me an email. I'll send you some catalogs. Call if you need any information. I'll leave links in the description. Thanks for stopping by. See you next time.